Holy shit. That's the word you can describe to buy six and sixteen. And it's like holy fucking shit. Now let's not get right into it. Um we give you bounce by line and and to the main event and then we come out and say one white thing. Um the op the pre try then wash, so this goes to the opening match, which was the women's match for the Fire Five from the World Smash side. And those the positions for me with this pay-per-view were pretty not good, <laughs> let me tell you. Um but I did but did the right in this match. Um, Nikki Bella got taken out of the match, so it was really on the tire, and the crowd was pretty happy, which, but, got scanned up, for God, for God's sakes. <laughs> but, yeah, it was a good match. It felt a little bit rushed, like, the eliminators were going over very quickly. It was a little bit of a song, but I did predict the team wanted to win, and they did win. So yeah, Ben and was Ben and Sean, Sean and Sean got the victory. Um, Nia Jack got shockingly eliminated, which was a little bit odd, considering the foot that they gave it to Nia. It seemed very shocking and strange that they would do this. Like, I don't know when, so yeah. Um, so let's see. So, 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 Team Owen and then Charlie be your last Uh, I think the next was the IC title match, Miss vs. Sami Zayn. To me, this is an underrated match. Um, Miss is constantly good, and Sami Zayn. It's always great, so this was a pretty damn good match. Pretty damn good match. And the mystery team, I got it one from. It was good because two ty two makeups, well, titles, so makeup titles have always been pretty rough. <laughs> Let me tell you, pretty rough. But yeah, the Miss Ray thing. Uh, the, the 10 on 10 tag team, one versus my time, man. Was, this was almost, it looked like it was almost going to be the same as the women's match. But the final two was just great. The, 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 but before that, the match was, Little bit messy, and the um, and the elimination were again like the women's match were going over pretty quickly, like pretty quickly. But the final two, Cesaro and Shaman, and the Uso were pretty damn good. Kind of wish it was a American Alpha that stop, but nonetheless, this was right here, Cesaro and Shaman. Look like they are starting to cash on as a team. Look like. So, yeah. It looks like they are click, stuck and click. So, yeah. Team all to the that team division win. Next uh, was the Cruiserweight Championship. It was like, it was a decent match, but... A similar story for the other I thought it was still so blazed and the crowd seemed to not care that much, really. Um, there was a one close spot where you could either did a flame move over the board. Could easily see how it's not a 
some more games that he gave all those spots, all those crazy ones, and still never been like really good. So, yeah. But the thing was just pussy out. And since if they were gonna just keep the wall division, the, the cruiserweight division wall, couldn't they just let like, Kendrick win clean? But that would hurt him. To me, the CQ finish was just so. And they were gonna do this, at least have it be. cost them the mess, not by DQ. That's just stupid. But then again, he did. So, but it doesn't make sense either. So, yeah. So. Now let's go on to. Easily the best match of the show. The Firefly Man Raw vs. SmackDown match. Pretty, pretty awesome. Everyone was like, the one negative of the match was the two most popular wrestlers on the Raw roster. Killer Chris Jericho's guy, I mean, because of the fucking list. They were guys living by that thing. That's become the most older thing in the company right now. Think about that. That was really like, uh, the day you get held on that really great. Boss Storm is really good. Um, the elimination was a second I predicted. And this was everything I expected to be. Like, the James Elso grabbing Boss Storm is. Like angle and then but and then after he got Braun got eliminated, he throws rings elsewhere out of the state, that was awesome. The shield triple power one was cool. Really was worthy for Shane. He looked like he was really out of breath. This is one of the first that I say you can tell like Physically, Shane looked really out of breath. So, yeah, really worried for Shane here. Thank God he's alive, though. But that night, I was very worried. So, yeah. And then, the fire, too. And then, Bray Wyatt actually won, guys. Well, he got me in the fall. He won a major pay per view. Holy shit, they were last to survive, Bray Wyatt. Wow, so I really think the after they go gonna do this me two scenario. They gonna win the SmackDown Tati Championship and then probably lose a mom for Reese and then do the blow off match at Mania. So yeah, if they do it with this could stay all the way to Mania, so yeah. Great, great match, and then the main event. <sighs> Go and rest with Brock Lesnar. <laughs> so, this match. Shockingly, Go and got sheer. Which I did not expect. This was all a shocker. But then, Go and just Pulls it and the lesson just really grind and Gova just really pushes him. And Gova hit two spear and jack him in one freaking minute 25 seconds and BAM! Gova beat Braun Lesnar again in one minute! Holy shit, though, that is lucky to have the narrow regard. Boy, this is also on pay per view. Man, people are in. Piss. Boy. Boy, go with the fear, bro. This, man. You know, after a week, after days, think about it. I think the any I think the whole time thing was great. Uh, it, it's like. Yeah, an ideal world, a junk dish of a young guy, the feeling, but 
It has to feel. It has been feel like products that have been co-opted and they frequently are. See, mostly the last thing that ever said you would see too long to happen. And then it just keeps. It seems like it still has been dropping it. So yeah. So I don't think what I'm memorable. Man, that was a shocking thing. Go with it. And, and this was the old Goldberg, which I don't think we ever seen that in from his first one, WWE. I don't think we ever see Goldberg like that. So he was the WWE, so but nice person, bro. It's not that I'm doing a second one here, so. I thought it was great and it gave us that shock that we kind of need at this point. So yeah, I think it's going to be going far predictable. So yeah, so I thought it was a great, a great energy. It was a match, like it was just a match. It was, it was a really good squash I really think that so yeah I thought that whole thing was it and and um and it kind of eliminates well there's a for the invincible book in which people started to see, see right through that so I thought it was really good the whole time the all time there was good. And bro actually wanted this by race. So he could do a rematch with him, which so yeah, which probably gonna happen which most like, will happen in Mania by right. I think it's gonna happen in Mania, so I thought the three seven was the whole time there was good. And to and so I said it was good. It was good. Um, so yeah, that's my entire thought of this whole pay per view. So yeah, so for the time, I like to subscribe. What do you think about the shocking finish in the comment section below? And just my genius, and I approve this match.